welcome back to the channel. As some of you may have seen in my previous video, this is part two of my Lego plates collection. If you haven't seen part one, please check my channel and have a watch. So we move on to the second part. Part one covered most of the one by plates, but not all of them. The difference with the one by eight plates compared to the smaller sizes is I don't have as many of them so I tend to keep them in just two containers um, all the same size so all the one by apes are all kept together you will see that I have two containers all together and I keep them separated by shades so the whites grays and black and then the colors the cool colors and then the warm earthy colors kept together With the 1x10 and 1x12 plates I have even fewer of them so they tend to stay in a different container but separated nonetheless. This helps me to find them when I need them. With the 2x plates you can see that the colours are very much the same as the 1x plates and this aesthetically works for me and makes it really easy for me to find them for when I need them. You can see here what I class as the common colours, which is the basic Lego colours that I seem to have the most of. And these are all organised and stored exactly the same way, making it easy for me to find. We can see here that I keep the two by twos at the front of the container and then just behind those I keep the two by threes and behind those I keep the two by fours. So it's just a very easy way for me to see exactly what I have. We can see here that there are a number of what I would class as rarer two by plate colours. So we can see the blues and some other shades of blue and purple. We can see here that we have the dark and light greens. And we can see here that we have various shades of browns and reddish browns, all kept individually. And I do have an overflow of parts in the two by plate such as these colors here I tend to keep them separated making sure there's enough in here to use but not overflowing so what can we expect in part three well part three should cover the larger two by plates such as the two by six and greater I will also try to show you the odd shaped plates as well such as the corner plates Thank you very much for watching please like and subscribe and whilst you are at it please have a look at my social medias such as my instagram and also my twitter so thank you very much again and take care